We're here at Fontana Raceway in the middle of the NASCAR track and I've seen a few of these online when I've been watching videos on YouTube and this is massive, but nothing that prepares you for driving past that grandstand. It's ridiculous. Well, I'm here with CJ and her WRX and she's been racing around here all day doing uh, laps and laps and laps and just getting seat time so that you can try and get your uh, race license yes, next year. that's correct. So how long have you had this car? I've had this car, it'll be four years in March. Okay, so March. it's not too late. And you bought it bone stock blue or yeah, did you it, repaint uh, it blue? Black and blue. Nice. And then you put all the stickers on it and did it all up in yes. the WRX. Yes. Nice. And then started just making, throwing more parts at it to make <laughs> it more and more replica as it went on. Yeah. And it's kind of escalated from there. Yeah. It's, um, <laughs> it's interesting because I wanted to go for rally. Yeah. And Hence the Subaru. <laughs> yeah, the Subaru. And then I had the livery because I was inspired by Oliver and Peter Solberg. Yeah which are the famous rally drivers. Mm -hmm. um, and then I was looking into the school and I was like, oh, Dirtfish Rally. I was like, man, I hope that's here yeah. in California. Yeah, that's Since, all in yeah. Washington. Isn't it? Yeah, and I was so like, far. so the school is like oh, four grand, five grand. And plus on top of that, I have to pay, pay for the plane ticket, you know, food, water, rental. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, I needed, I don't even know what else I'm gonna need. But clothes, cause it's gonna be freezing out there. Well, I don't how, have a lot of the weather stuff. The like how long are you up there at a time? Is it like a week, a weekend, a month? It's, I think it's three, I don't know if it's a weekend or I'm gonna say two to four days okay. at most. Yeah, so that's why I decided to go for the track. And I know it's a Subaru, you know, being a track car is not really the most ideal because it's all wheel drive. And you typically would want to favor a rear wheel drive car. So. Audi would beg to differ. <laughs> I know. Audi, Audi entered touring cars in Europe and absolutely dominated and wrecked everybody to the point where they were banned. Um, so you're fairly local to here and you've got Owendale and everything else. So mm -hmm. you've got quite a few options to get Exactly, yeah. Things. That's where I'm going at, yeah. Yeah, okay, that's cool. So how much longer do you think you need before you sort of start applying to push through your, or what are the requirements to get the race license? The requirements, I'm honestly not too sure well, because you, it's more than anything. Is it just the same time before you can get started and you can yeah. accelerate that with more stuff? Or exactly. Just, okay, that's not so bad. Then. Yeah, it's not like a, you need to have completed a thousand hours or a hundred hours of track time. Yeah, it's not like being a pilot. <laughs> it's like a whole okay. other story. That's, that's not so bad. Then. Yeah. Okay. Um, and so, what have you done to the car specifically? The engine still relatively stock. The engine is stock. Okay. It has <laughs> the engine has 177,000 miles on it. Wow. Okay. So, it, so, so it's, it's a lot. It's nowhere near stock. It's real tired. It's <laughs> it's, it's well bedded in. It's done. <laughs> <laughs> um, but other than that, you know, it's got a it's got a stage Take two coffee. tune, so that's custom. Oh, okay. I'm not pushing a whole lot of horsepower just because I'm trying to enjoy the car and have it last, so that yeah. way I can enjoy the time around the track. Sure. You're for, trying to get miles in more than anything and get seat time. And yeah. Get, like set records. Yeah. At that point, it's more of just like I want to enjoy the car, enjoy the track, get it, get the experience because this is the only car that I have. I know I still have a 2021 STI that I could track, but I don't think that's a good idea. <laughs> yeah, you don't want to bend your daily. Mine's on, I don't know about yeah. yours. something that's dedicated to the track and actually use it for that. Go, oh no, I broke it. <laughs> yeah, so it's like overall, I pretty much have a lot of, I feel like I have more safety and maintenance put into it than actual yeah. aftermarket. So have your aero separator, I have some aftermarket coolant hoses from Mishimoto. I have a reliability focus. Yeah, focus. like yeah, and as you say, safety. Yeah, so okay, that's intake cool. so how and everything you done else. Today, because you were here yesterday and today as well. Yeah, you see, you've done two days back to back. Mm -hmm. um, what were you looking for? Performance, uh, sorry, personal performance gains, like time gains, were here, or, or just laps and laps and laps? Yeah, well, laps too. But most importantly, I wanted to challenge myself. Um, that is to just get a better lap time than where I was on Saturday. So Saturday, um, I, I was, um, I had a two minute and 36 second lap time. Okay. And then today I ended up with a 219. So I made some adjustments. That's, that's what, 17 seconds? Yeah, and that's pretty good. Yesterday's PB, like that's, that's a good like 24 hour improvement in yeah. anybody. And it's a small win, so it's yeah. just how I see it. And, and the car's in one piece. Yeah. Like it hasn't that's worked, another, yeah. Like you've improved, the car's in one piece. Yeah. 
I call that a win. That's yeah. like the pilots. Any landing you walk away from is a good landing. Yeah. <laughs> Numbers look good, yeah. so everything everything's doing just fine. If you drive the car away from the track, call it a win. Yeah, exactly. So, oh, that's awesome. So hopefully we'll see you more on Blacklist as well next year, and we'll do more things because we're going to be coming year, back sure. over here again next year to do some more stuff. So there's a whole bunch of people who want to check out Blacklist Garage, which is Van, uh, his group, which we're part of, and you will have seen us last year with John, Mad Scientist Garage, building the Wrath Finder and a bunch of other things as well. So there's loads and loads of content coming. Obviously, you've seen some of the in-car stuff we've had from CJ driving around here as well. So thanks very much for, for sharing that You're with welcome. us as well. And Thank and, you for coming out here. And before it gets completely dark, we can sign <laughs> off and uh, probably head back to the UK. So yeah, I know. <laughs> thank you very much for watching. If you want to support the channel, you can go to pedalbox.show and you can buy merch, t-shirts, hats, although this is actually my friend's uh, decimal tenths hat, not mine, because <laughs> I ran out of stock. Go me. Um, and it's also December. Who has caps in stock in December? Uh, you can also support us on patreon.com forward slash pedalbox show. And don't forget, if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel, hit the little bell, and you'll get notified when all of our videos go live. Thanks very much for watching, and we'll see you next time.